Things to do in Warwick, New York. That's what we're talking about today. So don't go anywhere. Hi, my name is Jacqueline Krasuski. I'm a real estate agent with the Green Team in beautiful Warwick, New York. And if you haven't already subscribed, what are you waiting for? Hit that button below. We talk about all things real estate and the Hudson Valley. So today we're talking about things to do in Warwick, New York. Give you a hint. One thing to do is right over my shoulder. Yes, Board & Brush just opened up in Warwick, New York. Board & Brush is the largest DIY franchise in the United States. You can go on their website. There are way too many choices to choose from. But a bunch of my girlfriends and I got together. So what you do is you go on their website. You pick the pattern that you would like to do. I pick the world map. On it says enjoy the journey, the Krasuskis. And you'll see through some photo photos throughout this video some different things people chose to do. Again, way too many choices. But it takes about three hours. You go in. Of course, we started with a glass of Prosecco because I'm really not sure how else you would start to do this. I mean, that's step number one. Yes, they do have wine and beer. Um, they have everything laid out for you, your boards. You need to distress your boards. So if you need to get some aggression out, this is a good time. They're going to give you a hammer and chains and all that fun stuff to distress your board. You need to pick this colors. I picked just a darker stain with the white for the world and uh, blue for the names. But you can pick any color combination that you like. And they have plenty of boards all over the place for you to see how it would come out. You have to stain both sides of the board. That part does get a little smelly, but what are you going to do? It's stain. Um, and then they give you your stencil, which you're going to roll out. Of course, I, I picked the difficult one, but it was so worth it. And I, I had some good friends really helping me. But overall, we had such a great time. So if you're looking for something creative to do, or hey, the holidays are right around the corner, you can make some great gifts. You'll notice in the photo, one of my friends made a Christmas tray. Um, so that's right on West Street in Warwick, New York. Something really fun to do. Like I said, it's about three hours, and I believe they have some day and night classes. And the room holds about 30 people. So you can definitely get a bunch of people going. You do not need to book for 30 people. There's about six at a table. Um, so again, a lot of fun, something new and exciting to do in Warwick. And again, you can make a gift for anyone you like. Also this weekend to note at the Warwick Valley Middle School on December 1st is their annual craft fair. This is a huge event with local crafters from all over the place selling their goods. It's a great place to Christmas shop. Don't have the exact hours and I should because I'm on the PTA. I want to say it probably opens around nine. I think it's nine to five. So check that out this weekend in Warwick Valley Middle School. Also, if you're in town, horse and buggy rides, as long as the uh, weather permits, starting at 11 a.m. free on Saturday and Sunday. Again, thanks for watching. I hope you have an amazing day and talk to you soon. And leave me a comment below and let me know if you've done board and brush um, in your area, even if you're not in Warwick and what you thought of it. Thanks again.